Hi everybody, today I am sharing with you some of my favorite things. Welcome back everyone. Every month I save all of my favorite finds for you guys because I get really excited and I think I got to share this with everybody. I love this. And then usually by the end of the month I have like a whole pile of things, like 20 things, and then I have to whittle it down. So now today I'm gonna show you my top one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, just a bunch of favorite things. So the first um, item that I wanna share with you is this cream and it was actually sent to me by Robin McGraw. I'll just put it here for you. It's the Live Life Lifted. It is the Firming Neck and Chest Cream from Robin McGraw. So I was sent this about a month ago and um, I'll just show you this container. I think it's, the container is actually really pretty. I like how she styled it. Anyway, so I was sent this and I didn't wanna do anything with it until I had tried it for about a month. So what I have done is I have um, applied it on my neck and jawline, my chin and my chest for three weeks. And I don't understand all the technical jargon. I'm not gonna give it to you. You can look it up online, but it basically absorbs moisture plumps your skin, decreases the small fine lines and wrinkles, and also um, lightens any uh, age spots. And I found it did actually what she said it did. And for the price point, this is a $50, I think it's $42 US, which is like roughly $50 Canadian. For a $50 cream, I found less spots, a decrease in the fine line wrinkles. I actually really enjoyed it. It's light, it's not sticky, I have used it every day and I never use anything every day. Like I am, if you guys don't really know this by now, I'm a total minimalist. I barely use cream on my face. I'm just don't like a lot of stuff. And so I, I found this to be a really enjoyable experience. If you can say that about a cream, it's light, it smells good and it actually does what it's supposed to do. I actually had fine lines on my neck and I noticed a, a visible difference after three weeks. So I would like to say thank you to Robin for sending me this. It's a great product. I really liked it. You did a great job and I appreciate being part of your trial. So thank you and um, I highly recommend it, you guys. It's definitely worth the $42. Check it out. Let me know. Send me your uh, pictures. I want to see. And she has good before and after pictures on her site too, which I just looked up. So that was my first thing. Been using it for three weeks. I can definitely say thumbs up. My next thing I got to tell you, I'm so pumped about this. So I was speaking in Toronto for Women of Influence and the makeup artist there was using Nude by Nature. It is a cruelty-free brand out of Australia that's mineral-based makeup. And so here's the benefits. It is PETA certified, it is cruelty-free, it is based from minerals, it doesn't have a bunch of crap in the products, which is something that I really don't like. They sent me a big box of everything, so thank you, Nude by Nature, I really appreciate it. I, I'll tell you what I loved, what I became obsessed with. This is the Precision Brow Mascara. I really loved this product. If you're an everyday woman like me and you don't like wearing a lot of makeup, I just really don't spend the time to put it on. I thought this was so awesome. First of all, let's look at the packaging. It's beautiful. And this stuff is sold at Shoppers Drug Mart. So for an everyday product, I would highly recommend it. And check out this little tiny wand. It's really cute. So I literally get up in the morning and this is one of the things I use. I put on like a tinted um, face cream and I just put that on and then I use this little brow wand. It's awesome and that's it. And then I put on some lip balm and I go out the door. Nude by Nature, I really liked it. It's very affordable in Shoppers Drug Mart and I thank you guys for sending it to me. Um, the other thing I really liked, there's a creamy matte lipstick. I thought this was really cute. I'm wearing it right now. So there you go. And um, the mascara I tried, I also loved the mascara. It has a great wand, a great um, feel. This wand is awesome. 
it is a mineral-based product, and sometimes for mineral-based products, you don't have the same amount of pigmentation that you do on other uh, makeup products. However, I'm a bit of a minimalist, and so I like things a bit muted, and I don't really like them in my face. So for an everyday woman, I think this Nude by Nature is an amazing product. It's a great find. The price point is awesome. These are the three that I really enjoyed out of the collection um, that they sent me. So check it out. You can buy them online, or you can pop into your Shoppers Drug Mart and... Check them there. I talk about Pura all the time. And actually, Ryan's telling me I talk about Pura too much. But I, I just wanna say, I, I really feel like they don't get enough credit for their jewelry line. They're very well known in the West Coast. They're hot in LA, a lot of celebrities wear them. But I just feel like they're not widely known in like the rest of Canada and some of the East Coast of the States. This is one of the rings that they sent to me. I really like it. I wear this all the time. I was just on City Line. I wore it on there and got tons of compliments. The idea behind Pura, and I'll just read it to you, they cast using authentic wax seals and imagery from the Victorian era. They have symbolic meaning and each piece is designed to inspire, inspire the wearer. They've been around since 1995 and they just have a variety of pieces. I'm wearing some of the bangles, if you can see these. And these ones actually have crystals on the end. Um, which I love. You know what, I love the jewelry. It's chunky, it's fun, it has meaning. I feel like I like the crystals and the energy that goes with that. Um, this is a, a bracelet that I'm actually giving away to my girlfriend Toby's daughter for her graduation. I don't know if you can see this, but um, this one says the star featured on this talisman is a reminder of the inner light that guides our dreams and ambitions. So just things like that, like they make an amazing gift. So I'm gonna give this to Ava for her graduation, um, myself and my friend Erin, and I feel like she can wear it and then she remembers her inner light. Like it's just, it's a nice gift. It's beautiful and it's got some, uh, some symbolism there and it's really well crafted. I've bought some other jewelry and it tends to tarnish and wear and I'm gonna tell you, Pura, the quality is amazing. So if you're paying a little bit more, it's not that expensive, but if you are paying a little bit more, don't worry about it because you're absolutely gonna get your money's worth. So that's my other find. Moving on, I have been on search for the perfect round bag. These are really trendy right now and they range in price anywhere from like $60 to 500 for a wicker bag. This one I found at Gypsy Soul and it actually comes in another color. I'm just gonna show you. These ones are at Gypsy Soul Designs. I wore this one out the other day. I put my cell phone in it. I had my key car keys and my Nude by Nature lip gloss. And I thought it was a great bag. It's cute, it looks great, and it just gives your outfit a little bit of pizzazz. So those are something that I'm loving right now. And when I was in there, Brandy was like, check out these visors. I'm like, come on, this visor's wicked. So I live in a sunny location, I have a pool. Um, I always have my hair twisted up into a bun or a pony and it's hard to wear a, a baseball hat that way. So actually I found this and I love it. I'm like, I need to own this visor. So that way I can pile my hair all up and wear it. I think it's cool, it looks great. So um, they have a few of these. I know there's not a ton left. I mean, I know there's not a ton left of the bags, the visors, again, these are from Gypsy Soul. I'll put a link down below. This is so interesting. So I was in one of my favorite stores in Kelowna, it's called Olive and L. And I always like to go in there. Actually, the reason I went in there, to be totally honest, is I buy this dish soap. It's by a company called Caldrea. I'm obsessed with all of their products. I buy their detergent, their dish soap. This is the counter spray. This counter spray is pear, pear blossom and agave. I'm not kidding, it smells wicked, it cleans super well, it's not full of a bunch of crap. So I literally drove all the way downtown to pick up these items at Olive and L. And then when I was there, I was kind of scoping it out, I'm like, what else do you guys have Like that's awesome? And I came across these, and to be totally honest, I just fell in love with the look of them. I'm like, what are these? I was looking for napkins. And then I realized they're an alternative to plastic wrap and they're made actually in Victoria. So I'll show you. This is another one, like how pretty are these? Like who doesn't want their bowls covered with this instead of clear saran wrap? 
And here's the benefit because I'm really trying to get away from like plastic wraps and any stuff sort of stuff like that that is damaging to our environment and not reusable. And so what they are is reusable plastic wrap. Check it out. They're made of wax paper. And basically you take your bowl and so you have your leftovers in it and you just cover it and I'll just show you. And you just pull it tight and I kind of fold it over when I do it. It's really awesome. And then your food is covered. How cute is that? And it stays covered and it stays tight. And then when you want to go to use it, you just take this off and you reuse the wrap. I love it. And I was a little bit worried because sometimes I like make like curries or chilies or stuff like that. And I, I said to them, I'm like, well, what if it gets on the inside? Then it's all gross. And they said, you just rinse it off in cold water. And actually, so that did happen. I did have a dinner party and I covered all my bowls with all of these um, Goldilocks, you know, reusable covers. And they did get crap inside them and I just rinsed them off under cold water and let them dry and then I reuse them again. So I think these are an amazing, and if you're looking for a hostess gift, what a great gift to pair with like cool dish soap and the counter spray. Seriously, this is the bomb.com and if you're going to a party, what better than to give a hostess? You can give them a bottle of wine, but also what a cute gift to give something like this. Anyway. Those are my favorite things. So I feel like I've given you like a wide range from like cream that stops you from wrinkling, from a visor, good makeup jewelry. I've got the cross. What do you call that? Cross, cross, help me. Cross section. Cross section. It's a cross section of goods. Anyway, I hope that you guys like these things. These are my favorite finds for this month. Legitimately, I'm obsessed with each of them. And um, I hope that you enjoy them. I'll put links down below so that you can find those where to find them. I'll put links down below so you can find them. Because you guys do email me. And for those of you that do email me, it's a description box. So people always say like, where can I find this or that? But if you just click on, I believe it's an arrow you just click on and then the description drops down and that's where I put all the links. Also, if you hit subscribe, I actually email the videos out and they come with the, everything that I've talked about is a list and it comes straight to your email. So you can just click on that. So hopefully that works for you guys. I hope you guys have a great weekend and it's nice to see you guys on Fridays. Bye. Welcome back. Hi. Hello. Along my travels month to month before I, I'm like slurring. Uh, okay. So I always, I just burped mid talk. <laughs> nice. I, you're rolling.